Meanwhile, in Karnataka, H.T. Kumaraswamy has triggered the language war all over again. He's shot off a letter to Chief Minister Baswaraj Bomaya urging that the government shouldn't celebrate Hindi Divas. He's claimed that forcefully celebrating Hindi Divas would amount to injustice to the people of Karnataka. The language war Nautica is back. Former Karnataka CM H.D. Kumaraswamy reignited the Hindi versus Kannada war. After shooting off a letter to CM Bombay opposing Hindi Divas event on Wednesday, calling celebrations glorifying Hindi and injustice to Kannada and forcible imposing of Hindi. In the federal system, every uh, language is of equal importance. Central government trying to impose Hindi on us is absolutely uncalled for. BJP defended Hindi Divas, saying it doesn't diminish its zeal and love for Kannada language. Mother tongue of an every regional language is a position of the mother's place. Naturally, we are given up. That doesn't mean that we should hate the other language. I don't think, uh, I mean, what Mr. Kumar Swami has spoken, that we should uh, go and protest uh, against Hindi or this thing. Hindi is one of our uh, Indian languages and it should be celebrated. But the Congress, which is fighting to reclaim lost ground in Hindi heartland, appeared split on celebrating Hindi Divas. What is happening here in Karnataka is that you are forgetting a classical language, the rich heritage, the legacy of uh, Kannada and glorifying Hindi. That is something wrong, is something that we are saying. We are not against Hindi. But you cannot have uh, Hindi enforced upon us who have a very, very rich literature uh, background, literary background of uh, our classical language. Kannada is our uh, priority language and it is an official language, no doubt about it, but please understand, Hindi also is a national language, understand? We may be speaking uh, less Hindi here, but it doesn't mean that uh, you should not observe that. I don't agree with Kumar Swami. Several Kannada groups in the past have resorted to vandalizing and blackening Hindi ports. Also staging protests against Hindi. Is the language war being used as a political tool in pole-bound Karnataka? With Nagarjun Dwarkanath in Bengaluru, Bureau Report, India Today.